I thought I'd do a quick video on how to install a new satellite into an inexpensive free satellite receiver. And for this, we're going to be using this receiver from GT Media, the V7S. They're pretty inexpensive. You can probably find them for about $50 on Amazon. Most of the interfaces seem to be the same on these cheap receivers, so here's how it's done. Here's your remote. Go to Install Satellite List. Hit the red button on the remote, Add. And then push the OK. That gives you a keyboard on the screen. And you can add in the name of your satellite. We'll call this one Nighty West. And we'll save that with the yellow button. And you can see all the colored buttons on the screen. That's the guide as to which buttons to push on your remote control. Now we'll add our longitude. Change that to west. And hit confirm. And now we have to go and change our LMB. This is very important. If your LMB frequency and type is not set correctly, you won't get any signals at all. We have a universal LMB on the dish I'm using. So we'll use this setting here. We're not using a dissect switch here. Now we'll hit exit and save this information. And you can see so far we're getting a pretty strong signal, 85%. And I haven't added in a transponder, but I know that this dish is aimed properly. So I'm going to go ahead and scan this. We're doing a blind scan here. So hit search. And these channels are actually from 95 West. The type of type of dish I'm using has a dual LMB. This dish has a dual LMB with a 22K switch built in. So if you aim it right, you can receive two satellites off of one cable.